Hello, it's Atharal here, and today we are back once again with our Stellaris Galaxy Divided mod, where we've been playing as the Jedi. You can see I have skipped forward a bit of time this one, and I've managed to get myself the uh, Clatoon sector, I believe it is. Clatoon, yeah. Uh, there's been a slight issue, to say the least. Um, well, not so much an issue as such, but the Galactic Republic and the Stellar League have declared war, which are the Mon Calamari are on the side of the enemy, which is a problem for us in a sense because we weren't really prepared for it so you know we're in a bit of a sort of, not quite a tight situation with that sense but we're just gonna we're gonna move these guys forward to make sure as we were not prepared to be doing any invasions or anything like that i can tell you that one which is a big problem okay so these guys are moving so they're not really all that much use to us but you know what let's have a look let's have a quick check of this planet right uh, it's not got much energy credits it doesn't really generate very many so i'm going to get myself a power plant i mean i could get a power hub to be honest and that would probably benefit me just as much we've had to start trying to build up some army some armies we didn't have any originally that we don't worry about them too much so we didn't have any armies and now we're probably going to pay the price for not having any armies and that is going to be a Big problem because now we've got this big force here. Uh, well, big border with the Mon Calamari who could attack us from this side and probably will, I suspect. So, what we're going to try and do is we're going to build up our armies and we're going to try and hold this. Oh, planetary shield generators. It's a good thing I got that one. Research alternatives, I think, might not be a terrible idea. Basic combat roles and um, specialized computers for combat. Yes. Right. So, get rid of that. that. Uh, inactive building. Why is there an inactive building? Because you are there. So you are going to cancel that. Yes. Right. And then improve this. What do we need? We need um, either physics or engineering. So we're going to get an engineering one, I think. Our, all of our actual research is more or less balanced out now, which is a great thing. And so let's have a look. So we've got this sector here as well now, which is, as you can see, has expanded very far. It's a very nice little sector. Oh, and these guys have managed to... Uh, got someone employed. Why are they unemployed? They're unemployed because they've just sort of shown up. But this planet is now finally finished, more or less. So, right, let's have a look. What are we doing? So, not very much research going on. So, let's build a research lab. Yes. Improve the food. Uh, improve the money. Yes. Improve that. Improve that. And uh, build some more. Let's have a look. What should we build? Planetary shield generator, but we don't have planetary capital to be able to use that, so that's not too much of a worry. Let's build, uh, what do you reckon, mine there? Yeah, I think a mine there would be good. You will build some more food. Not that we're going to need food, but you never know. And improve that. So there we go. What is it? Let the dead alien lie. Yeah, let them lie. Right, so, oh, we can improve that there. So, planetary administration. Build up a basic power plant. Definitely build some basic mines here. We need more mines. Right. And some more food. Yes. Always need food. Food is always a good thing. Right. And you, we're going to convert you into food. And we're going to improve you in mining. There we go. Right. So, there's a lot going on here. Right. So, what is this? This is a colony ship that was just kind of chilling here, apparently. Hmm, fair enough. A uh, construction ship. Where is... Okay, you're there. Brilliant. So, we're going to get you to go along and build a load of stuff so that we can get some more resources from this area. Oh, we're at 12%. That's good in terms of war score, and we are still safe. We're going to swap you out to there. And, no, we're going to swap you out to there. I think that'll be a good system to have. Yes. Right. So, I think everything's doing well. Uh, oh, two of our places are starving, however... So this one, hmm, right, so you're starving, and that's probably because all your people keep trying to move away. If you stop trying to move, then we might be okay. Surface of this, however, right, so you are going to go there, and you are going to build a hydroponics farm for us to try and sort out the food deficit that that planet's having. So we need to keep an eye on this a little bit more over here. We're not wanting to attack as such ourselves. Ooh. And so, yeah, they've definitely, they've blockaded space battles. So, we're definitely, we're winning. Negotiate this. We could, well, 
send a white piece off to end this, only the main attacker or defender, which is the Galactic Republic and the Nemoidians. So ourselves and the Calamari got kind of dragged into it. Uh, the, a lot of people really against, going against the Galactic Republic, not a good idea. And we're not going to attack ourselves. We're going to be quite, well, quite peaceful. We're going to, you know, just trust in the force and that, oh, what's this? Right. So these people are coming to try and attack us. Well, that's not something that we can allow. So, right, where are these guys going to? Right, so, move over to here. Oh, God, there's a big force coming. Coming our way. Hmm. This is a problem. This might be a problem. This will be a problem. Okay, so. Right, so they are launching their attacks against us. Right. Can we at least stop some of them? Can we? Yes, hopefully we can. We're stronger than they are, so we should be able to take them down. Let's see how this fight does go. Uh, yeah, that is going pretty well. Right. And so... All of those, yes, they've been forced back. Please, please, please offer peace some point soon. Right, so keep chasing that fleet because we want to get that fleet so that they don't try to attack us anymore. They seem to be determined to, though, which is a problem. Hmm. We needn't, we're need. we beating them back, though. That's. I suppose that's kind of the important thing. An assault battalion. We're not going to be able to catch them, are we? Hmm. Uh, this is a problem. This is definitely a problem. Right. Right. Uh, let's have a look. Research. Okay, so our naval capacity has just jumped up by 10%. That's great. Uh, let's, yeah, let's put our naval capacity up again. We need to keep putting it up further. That's really the only option that we have. Let's go back to Orsus, though. So, right. Uh, we've got, what, just shy of 30. So we can get certainly 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, because that's 20. No, that's not. Let's get rid of these. We need these. Four, five. So that's 20. And then, so that'll put us up to 114. And each one of these, so 16, 18, 20, and one of those. So that second fleet is not going to be as good, but should be able to at least do something with any luck. Right, so improve. You are going to uh, improve our physics. Yep, I think that physics would be a good one. Right, uh, we need to get more energy credits on this planet. So, that's fine. Build a power hub and build another power hub. Right. What is this? Federation Invitation. They've joined the Concord. Mm, that's not great. Trade offer will be automatically declined. Active sensor link between us and the Wookiees. We will agree to that, yes. Because that's going to give us a lot of extra information. And the Wookiees, well, Wookiees are always good. We want to try and bring them into the fold if we could. So these guys are now running all over the place. Right, so we should be able to take them out with relative ease. Yep. Yes, we can. Brilliant. So, hmm. I don't, I don't like the look of this. I really don't. I don't know where these people are going, but I'm going to try and stop them, wherever that may be. Ah, brilliant. So they're 1.6, so I, I mean, I don't like my odds against that fleet, if I'm honest. But I'm going to try anyway. Right. And who is this we're taking out? So it's like one ship or something, isn't it? I don't know. Right. The important thing is that we are managing to take them out. So they are actually, they are moving through our lands. They're not really looking at stopping. So, hmm, turn you around and attack these guys, because this is a small fleet of ships that we can certainly try and stop. So, right, where is this science ship? So that science ship is there. Are you just, are you serving? You should be. Hmm. Hmm, indeed. Survey this system. You know what? Survey that. Survey that. And survey that. Probably not going to get all that much from these, but, you know, it's better to know about them than not. We're up to 52% in terms of the score as well, so that's good. Right. Come on, chase them down. 
what are these? Are these actually our enemy? First Republic Defense Fleet. Right. They would seem to be, hmm, a bit of a strange one, but let's, you know what, let's, let's jump in, let's try and attack these, well, maybe not attack these guys, but let's attack these guys. Do you reckon? Yeah, I think so. I think that might not be a terrible idea to try and chase them. Try and, yes, there we go. We're going to stop them. We're not just letting them on Calamari, you know, just wander through our area without being, you know, challenged in any way. That's for sure. Right, so, ooh. 29 ships can upgrade. Brilliant. Now the First Republic fleet in, is going to do that. And the third peacekeeping fleet is not great. So they are going to pretty much, well, they're only one ship strong. So we're going to leave them for a minute. Oh, what's this? Inactive buildings. Hmm. Right. You are going to move on to there. You're going to improve that. You're going to improve that. Uh, what should you improve it? Engineering. Uh, we, we can always use more engineering. Well, we can always use more in general of everything. Uh, it would seem that Koros is not doing great. That's a bit of a problem. It's not brilliant. Right, so... Hmm. It would seem like some of those ships are actually not, you know, not following the hyperlanes. That's not great. That gives them far more flexibility than we would like. You are... Okay, you're fine. So what is this planet? So you're quite close to losing money but I think that yeah we're going to build a planetary generator right so these guys are apparently are attacking us we can't allow that we're going to have to do something about this I think we may need to have a look at well you know we're going to have to have probably a look at trying to expand our guys in terms of military so shields or UV uh, UV lasers, I think, might not be a terrible... No. Hmm, I don't know. Uh, UV lasers. Let's get some better lasers. Uh, bomb wings. Defense station, yes. Get, a de get us a defense station. That would be a good one as well. And build up our military navy capacity. That way, we're going to just be, again, adding in even more stuff. Because there is just... Wow. So many guys. Right, so, you guys are... Are you actually... Yes? Come on. Come on. Build you back up to full strength. Right, you've lost one of your Archeon class cruisers. That's not great. We're going to need to do that. something about that. Because we don't want that at all. Right. Come on. Come on. Finish healing your guys up. And then we need to upgrade them once we've done that. Is that? Yep, there we go. And so upgrade them. So this is going to take them apparently quite a bit of a while. Uh, right. Yep, 7%, so that's going to take them a good long while. These guys have fully upgraded, though, which is a good thing. And it would seem like our amount of actual, uh, you know... Ooh, hmm, let's have a look. So, use can't do anything. What is this? This is Bis. Bis, you are going to build a shield generator. We need more shield generators. We need to ensure that our people stay safe. And that's the problem that we're having. Oh, station is under attack. Brilliant. You know what? That's just what we want. But actually... This might be okay. This is probably not going to be okay. But you know what? It would seem like they are determined. Hmm. Right. I know that you're at... Well, you're at 30%. You're, you're pretty far in terms of that. It would seem that they're, they're holding their own. The, the station is definitely, definitely, definitely holding its own. It's... I mean, it's not going to ultimately matter. It's going to go down. But you know what? You can try at least, I suppose. Right, so let's get rid of those. I think definitely having more, uh, you know, more of these to actually more defense stations and better defense stations is going to be the way we're going to need to go in terms of keeping our actual planets okay. We've got enough, you know, resources to be able to support them, but mm, mm, right, that one's going to be falling. Yep, that one has been destroyed. Great. That's not what you want. How is this fleet doing though? 77, 78, there we go, 80%. So it is improving. I mean, it's at 2,000 at the minute. So let's keep an eye on this and see how it does go. What is this doing? Right. Who is it? You are apparently unable to do anything. You're going to actually build us another one. Actually, no, you're not going to. You're going to cancel that. Yes. And you're going to move over to there. Right. 
and then you're going to move over to there. I think that's a good idea. And then you're going to build a mineral processing or a miner mining network. Mining network. Right. So they are going to be attempting to attack us, I suspect. So our fleet, how is it you're going? You're nearly at 90%, so you're nearly upgraded. Finally, I, I really hope that there is a big jump in terms of the strength for this fleet because, well, apparently you just need it. 2,000. Okay, a 5% increase. Not really worth the amount of time that that took. Although I suppose it could, you know, one day be the difference between losing and winning. So who knows? Actually, it might not be a terrible thing. Right, so you are going to... Federation, the fifth attack swamp. So you're going to try and attack them. No idea how this is going to go, but we'll keep an eye on it anyway. And, you know, we're at 64%, so we're not doing terrible. I mean, we're not doing amazing, but we're not doing terrible. And that's, I suppose, something at least. And we've managed to actually do pretty well ourselves in this war. We've contributed to it, certainly. We've won everything. We're, we've lost some stuff. Yeah, we've lost some battles. But the fact that we are the ones occupying planets and blockading planets, that is ultimately what is winning this war, I suspect. Let's have a look. How's this planet doing? Okay, you need more research. Yeah, more research it is. I think that'll be a good idea. Right, so where is this peacekeeping fleet? Right, so... Hmm, is there anywhere to move down to? Not really. So, you're going, you're going to stay there for the minute, actually. I think that's probably a good idea. Colony ship in land. So... You are going to colonize this planet. I think, yeah, yeah, that will be a good idea. So, we're going to get rid of that as well. Three. Okay. And so, let's get you to go there. And, right, there's another colony ship there, which I think you need to go down to here. I think. Right, colony 60%. Hmm. Jedi are 55%, so it's mainly, it's the Zabraks, which we would mainly want, want to be sending here, but we are going to colonize it regardless. So you're going to go down there, and this is two. Platoon two. There we go. So you're going to now go over there as well, and hopefully everything will get a bit nicer with that one. And look at the size of the Wookiee clans. The Wookiee clans, oh, I, lo I love them. They are so inferior. Right, asked to be their vassals. Offer tribute. Demand vassalization. We must be at peace. So, they're not going to do that anytime soon. Well, you never know, they might. With any luck, they might at least. Right. Swap you over to there. Hmm. You're looking at moving, so... Hmm. This is not great. That's not great. We've got a lot of people that are moving around. It's making our balancing of our empire an awful lot harder than it actually probably should be, really. Science ship, what are you doing? You're still going down there, trying to have a look. So, you're going to, once you've done that, though, you're going to survey that system. Then survey that. You're going to... Yeah, I think that'll be a good idea to, to jump around and survey all of this. Uh, survey this. And then sort of loop back on yourself. And then survey back up here as well. And then finally survey over here. And then if you can't find anything, then survey around here. I'll probably have hit some enemies at some point before that. And that'll probably stop me. But you never know. It might not at the same time. So I think we're going to leave it there for today. We'll come back next time to see how this war turns out. If you did enjoy the video, do be sure to hit that subscribe button so that you don't miss out with any other content. I've been Atharal here for EGEN, and I shall see you next time.